I tell you, it's a good time for, for 90s music right now. You know, it's very popular, and uh, and we're working as much as we, we want to work, and I'm thankful for that. Yeah, people are missing that there's not much of it coming out of Nashville anymore, that traditional stuff. Yeah, style. yeah, I guess we were the last, uh, you know, really traditional mm -hmm. country music to come out of Nashville, and so uh, when, uh, you know, all these places, the, the casinos and the festivals and the things want country music, they got to come to us because... Uh, we're the we're the we're the surviving uh, traditional country artists now. Guys like me and Lawrence and Chestnut and Diffie and all that '90s crew, you know. You're the real deal, and uh, I think the re most recent album came out in 2016. Was it All American Texan? That was All American Texan, and we released our first live album in November. Uh, we did a live at Billy Bob's, and uh, we've got that out uh, on all your digital formats, and okay. even got it on vinyl. Uh, if you go to my website at TracyBirdMusic.com, but. Uh, yeah, we got that out, and then I'm starting to, to, you know, get the itch to go back in and do a new studio album with all new songs on it, and so uh, hopefully have that out in the spring of next year. All American Texan, you uh, wrote eight songs on that album and yeah. recorded it in Tyler, Texas at Rosewood Studio? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, we recorded it uh, at Rosewood, and I'm gonna probably go back there and do the next one. I really like that place. I got some uh, really talented people up there and a great studio, and, uh, and it's fun you know, cutting in Texas. I'd never cut in Texas all those years. It was always Nashville or California that we tracked everything in. And uh, so it's really nice to have that great studio right up there in Tyler. comes this week's Honky Tonk Texas Fabulous Flashback. Tracy Bird, I've been a fan of yours since uh, before I moved here. It's now been uh, 16 years this month that I moved here and I met you shortly after that. Uh, it's actually the longest I've ever lived anywhere and I, I think you had something to do with that. Maybe Mark Chestnut too. I said this must be a pretty cool place if guys like Tracy Bird and Mark Chestnut chose to stay here when they could have lived anywhere else. Yeah, I mean, I, that is interesting, you know. I mean, we, we could have lived anywhere, and of course, we're pressured to live in Nashville, you right. know. They, you know, when you sign with a big label, they they want their, they want, to, want you to be a, within a phone call away from them, you know, to do whatever, which is a plus, a reason to live back home, you know, to get yeah. away from all that. But, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it was home for us, and we we uh, we stayed, and we enjoy it, and we love it, and we're still here, and uh, glad you're still here too. King of the road. 
That was this week's Honky Tonk Texas fabulous flashback. Since 2008, Honky Tonk Texas and Silsby has been serving up non-stop fun for Southeast Texas with live music and delicious adult beverages. Oh, and be ready to dance your butt off to the best in local, regional, and national touring bands. Of course, date night is every Thursday. And don't forget about the Honky Tonk Grill. Visit them online at facebook.com slash honkytonktx and at honkytonktexas.us. Honky Tonk Texas and Silsby has been serving it all up since 2008. Where have you been?